right, the FTAs are done with the laying of hands on the robot, and it has connected to the field. Pilots, prepare for blast off. Drivers, behind the line. Three, two, one, go. Do I still sound like an alien? No, I do not. All right, here we go, match number 59. We only have a couple matches left today for these teams to increase their seating. Will any button would able to win this autonomous mode? It looks like Rare Blue Alliance and Red Alliance both have a gear up. They're both gonna get that 20 point bonus for spinning up their first rotor in autonomous mode. Driver period, con driver control period begins. Looks like 399 is gonna be able to put up a gear real fast. Red already has three gears in hand. That's gonna be enough to spin up a second rotor and start on a third. Blue also spins up a second rotor, and we've got a really tight match, 110 to 115. Blue Alliance on top. Robots loading up on gears, returning to their airships, trying to score those gears and spin those rotors. This seems to be a pretty evenly matched matchup here in the early stages. Both teams have two rotors spinning. Both teams are well on their way to a third. It looks like Blue has the gear in hand, needed to spin up that third rotor. Let's see if they can do it. They've forgot to turn the crank, and she's got it. That's three rotors for the Blue Alliance, and they're starting on a fourth. Meanwhile, Red Alliance is one gear away from getting their third rotor. It looks like they have it in hand. Let's see if they can get it up and spun up. They've got it. Three rotors apiece. 155 to 150 with 50 seconds remaining in this match. Blue's on their way to a fourth. Red's a little bit behind. We'll see if either one can get it. It looks like this one might come down to those climbing points. That sound and those flashing lights means there's 30 seconds left in this match and pilots can drop their ropes. Once the ropes are dropped, robots can start boarding their airship by climbing the rope. They can grab on and they can climb up like 399 and 1868 are doing right now. If they can trigger that touchpad for one full second, they will receive an additional 50 bonus points. It looks like three red robots are up for red. Two for blue. Will that be enough to get it done? We shall see. There was one foul on team 199 for contacting an opponent's rope. That is worth five points to the Red Alliance. So with that, we will put up the final scores for this match. With 305 to 205, the Red Alliance is victorious. Mr. 305 makes an appearance again. Three rotors, uh, three rotors, three re hang robots, autonomous and uh, mobility bonuses, daring the Blue Alliance to, to overcome that. Red Alliance does it, takes away the win. What's so interesting to me about that, though, is the Blue Alliance was off to a faster start. They got three rotors so early in the match. They looked like they were definitely on track to get four rotors. They needed one more gear to get up there. But the Red Alliance did some very smart things at the end of the match there. They played some heavy defense on the Blue Alliance, not letting those robots cross the field to try to get home to deliver that last gear. So those last few gears took a very long time. And then at the end, a Blue Robot was trapped, looking for a way out, trying to get home. Do we have video of that, Frank?